this is what I wanted to share on Jeff Bezos here, who knows these principles and implements them very well when he was asked about a good quarter. And I've talked about this in some of my videos. I just wanted to share the clip and then do a quick explanation on this. I say thank you, but what I'm thinking to myself is they told him he had a good that quarter. quarter all that, those quarterly results were actually pretty much fully baked about three years ago. And so like today, I'm working on, you know, uh, a quarter that is going to happen in 2020, not next quarter. Next quarter, uh, for all practical purposes, is done already, and it's probably been done for a couple of years. Um, and so if you start to think that way, um, it changes how you spend your time, how you plan. You live uh, in the future, ladies energy, and gentlemen, and you uh, bring and, that future and, now. And your ability to look around corners gets better. So many things improve if you can take You longer. know the By future way, because, as Peter Drucker says, humans. you create so it. It's a, it's a discipline that you have to build. It's not natural the, on the 3D. Uh, the kind of, you know, uh, get rich slowly schemes are not big sellers on uh, info. Of course, it doesn't have you to know, be slow. Uh, and so. That's something that you have to sort of steal yourself for and discipline and teach um, uh, over time. Living in the future, ladies and gentlemen. So what Jeff Bezos does is he has already entered into the state four, three years from now of what he wants to create. And so when someone congratulates him for something that he has happened in this quarter, he's not even conscious of that because he's already living in another film role. And that's what we go into in this course about living already in the state that you want to create and you are multidimensional, meaning that you can exist in different dimensions at one time. And the arbiter of that is the feeling. You have the feeling of the state of being in that dimension and that is what Neville Goddard talks about and calls persisting. So if you persist in the state and persevere, you are already there. Therefore, when it happens in the present, you're not even so interested in it because you're already moving on to what you want to create next. We are constantly creating, and that's what we came here for, ladies and gentlemen. So this is Javier from The Real Javier Novoa. Subscribe and like to our channel because things are fixing to take off in a number of ways. In our courses, in our coaching, in our videos, and in everything that we do here as a community on The Real Javier Novoa. With much appreciation and love, thank you, and I'll see you guys very soon.